Hangs that one. Who's made the play? Double. That's been driving a run. Yes. Out. Out at second. No, I hate him that he swung it tonight. Popped up, that's gonna get down. Where is it? And that's not. And 
get some logic. Inside. Ground it. Here comes Alex Oppenheimer. Flashback to game one of the staple season one. He did this. And that ball struck the deep left field. Looks like it's gonna hit the wall. No, oh, it's a home run. That ball is out of here. That is the first home run for Staples this season as the crowd goes crazy. Alex Oppenheimer adds another run. Two and two. Struck him out looking. Out. What? Fights it off. A single for Cooks. Trying to go off, but he pulls it. Oh, and it's game! Oh my god, he hits the big target running to second. Grounder, got him perfectly placed, but he has trouble with it. Right back to Poops. That's an out. Popped him up. Alex calls him up. On the guard. Yeah, game one didn't really go our way. I uh, I didn't really pitch the way that I wanted to. Coming out of the pen, I felt really good, but my stuff really wasn't moving. Game two, I really felt good. Uh, didn't allow any runs, bats were working well, so we, we took took that game, but game three, just really unfortunate call at the end. I thought we played well again. My pitching was really good there. Really was able to pick up the team in that way. But held them to one as well. Yeah, held them to one run, but just, and in the end, uh, calls didn't go our way, so. Worst team in the league, absolute, they're terrible. Should have won game two, the bats weren't going. You know, Tony pitched a great game. You know, whipped out some things we'd never seen out of him before. You know, this year's the balls were scuffed. Things were moving a lot more, and you know, they scored a lot more runs off us than we I wanted, mostly because there was a radar. We couldn't really throw our stuff. We had to keep it slow. Usually we were throwing like 70, 75. Only could max out at like 60 today. You know, so it was tough. But, you know, I'm happy we came out the series 2-1, and it's a dub. Everyone says pitches are the dirtiest team in the league. You know, I agree with that. We play, we play pitches. Pitches with the ball, you know, pitches are cheaters, pitches, you know, we do what we want, we try and get any call we can. Yeah, I feel like if I had my normal speed, I would have been able to 
get the job done. It's really great knowing that I'm not the only one that's uh, pitching. Like I was last year on the Bombers, he was really tough though in every game. I would prefer a leadoff personally. I feel like getting on is the most important thing. Uh, we saw I'm not a, more of a, I don't hit as many home runs, so going the other way, leadoff, it's really good for us. Um, you know, they didn't go our way, but uh, no, I just couldn't seem to get the ball in my hands in the field, couldn't seem to make a play. You know, if we had Goldie here, I know he'd be stepping up and making some plays. Yeah, you know, um, they, when I'd play on one side of the field, they'd try to hit it to the other. Um, basic stuff like that, but you know, worked out pretty well for them. Uh, yeah, obviously, if Goldie was here, we would probably would have swept them. Uh, Goldie's like uh, one of the best players in the league, probably the second best player on the team after our coach, uh, maybe the third. Um, but yeah, if he was here, things would have turned out differently. I mean, it was tough getting stats, certainly, but I know that I wasn't playing my best. I wasn't playing how uh, the coach wanted to play Coach Pook, so I knew that he's, a, I, I kind of knew he's going to bench going into it. I was disappointed at first, but as soon as he called me back in at the end, I was I was pretty happy about that. I was like, I knew that uh, he could trust me again. I gained his trust back, and I was happy I made that play. Uh, that's a good question. I ask him all the time. I don't think he wants to be pitching as of right now, but I think that I could be a viable pitcher in a situation in which Andrew uh, Pooks isn't throwing in the way that they want to. I think that's important that we uh, we make sure we, that our viewers can trust that we're playing the game as uh, best as we can and we put on a good show. So I think that saying that, you know, they would have seen I hit my hand, maybe there would have been a mean comment. I don't know. But I think that it was best in, uh, it was best in interest for the organization that the Sons of Pitches and the organization that is Compo Football League.